A big celebration today for a local high school basketball team honoring their recent state victory. Wendell Phillips High School on the South Side was named the IHSA Class 2A champions. Nate joins us live with more from the big <laughs> celebration. What's up, my man? What's going on, Terrence? Hello there, Sylvia. It indeed is a day of celebration here in Bronzeville. As you just mentioned, the Wendell Phillips Wildcats bringing home, listen to this, guys, their first basketball state championship win in nearly 50 years since 1975. Before I get into the details of this story, I want to take you all to the very moment a couple of days ago downstate that these young players will never, ever forget. It's been 49 years, but once again, Wendell Phillips Academy, state champions. And people said it couldn't be done, and these young brothers proved all of their haters wrong. Check out their 2024 state championship trophy now on display for the world to see. On Saturday, the Wildcats defeated the Benton High School Rangers 54 to 47. Students, faculty, and alumni, along with city and state dignitaries, applauded the players today in a congratulatory assembly. The coach told me it truly is a story of hard work and resiliency as nine of their players this year, listen to this, nine of their players this season were transfer students. Many of the athletes had been overlooked for previous opportunities to play, but once they started believing in themselves and, of course, through support from family, coaches, and school leadership, the team soared. Now, earlier today, we heard from Mayor Brandon Johnson and one of the team's point guards about this outstanding achievement. Listen in. These young boys who are growing to become men, whether they play basketball, we have future firefighters or educators or doctors or lawyers or community organization leaders, corporate leaders, entrepreneurs, artists. These boys have more talents than basketball. I can assure you that. What does this really mean for you outside of basketball? Uh, it's great. It means a lot. Uh, I feel like it helped everybody on our team confidence go up even outside of basketball, not just on the court, but off the court too. Uh, we more focused. Uh, like the coach said, we got like a 3.3 uh, GPA. That's good. Yeah, guys, you heard it there. A 3.3, that was the average GPA that these players all had to maintain. But I tell you, so much pride here. Phillips, in fact, is the oldest African-American school in all of Chicago. The coach grew up in public housing and is a native of the South Side. We asked the principal here, what's next for the team? He says, Nate, another championship win. I love it, love it, love it. That's the latest here in Bronzeville. Nate Rogers, Fox 32 Chicago. They need you on the sidelines. You're a great cheerleader, Nate. Thanks for that fun report. <laughs> <laughs>